Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Alexis Clemens. A beautiful day across southern Wisconsin. A live look from UW-Madison looking east. A couple of uh, cirrus clouds in the sky, but otherwise a lot of blue up there. And that sun is shining and it's going to warm things uh, pretty seasonal for today. Highs in the mid to upper 70s. Here's what you need to know, though. We are tracking changes. Highs will be near 80 tomorrow ahead of the low 80s on Thursday. That's ahead of a cold front that it's going to provide some showers, maybe a couple of storms Thursday night. And and that system cools things down quite a bit. So if you haven't really felt like fall just yet, wait until Saturday. Things are going to be much cooler by then. Current conditions 69 in the capital city. A couple of clouds here and there. Dew points in the 50s. We love to see that. Things are very comfortable. Like we talk about dew points when they get into the 60s. That's when it starts to feel uncomfortable. And that's something that you might feel by Thursday ahead of a southerly wind at about 9 miles an hour. Warming things up and eventually going to bring us a little bit more moisture. That's going to lead to those rain chances late Thursday. Sunrise today at 624, sunset at 728. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. Tomorrow is the last day with 13 hours or more of daylight until April, so definitely soak it in while it's here. Temperatures warming to 77 this afternoon with a lot of sunshine. Clear skies tonight again dropping into the 50s as we begin your Wednesday. Clear skies right now, maybe a couple of clouds here and there. The big picture though, we've got high pressure. We've been talking about this for a while. High pressure sitting over the Great Lakes region region right now providing just this these sunny and seasonal conditions. But behind that system, winds are out of the south, which is what we're seeing right now, and that's going to help things warm up over the next couple of days. So 77 the high for today, still a lot of sunshine out there. As we head into Wednesday, those temperatures are getting a little bit warmer. I do think that winds stay fairly calm, but out of the south, that's just gradually bringing in more heat and humidity, which we will be seeing in abundance by Thursday. So it's getting warmer, high near 80 on Wednesday. Showers, though, late on Thursday. Really, I think that the time frame here is going to be Thursday night, but they could start as early as Thursday evening and end as late as Friday morning as that cold front sweeps through and then things will be much cooler as we head towards Friday. Really cooling things down. A couple of lingering showers on the backside of that system. Very possible there, but temperatures uh, much cooler highs in the low 70s by Friday and then in the low 60s by Saturday. So for Wednesday with that cold front, timing is absolutely everything because we're not expecting that storm system until Thursday night. You can see here uh, that that uh, that uh, the risk for severe weather is much lower. This is for Thursday here, a marginal risk. It stays to our northwest. We're not expecting severe weather. If that front would have uh, moved through a little bit earlier on in the day on Thursday, we wouldn't be dealing with that. But other than that, after this rain chance Thursday night, looking at fairly dry conditions as we head towards this weekend and next week. And we are cooling things down. Like we talked about, highs will be in the 60s as we head towards this weekend, but warmer than average conditions are expected after that. So the cool down doesn't last for very long, but take a look at how, how much we cool down. Like I said, 83 on Thursday, 62 the high on Saturday. So much cooler weather on the way. But like I said, I don't expect it to last too terribly long as highs will be in the 70s by the beginning of next week. But a lot of sunshine. We are tracking that rain chance into Thursday night, cooling down into the weekend and then back into the 70s by next Monday.